Hi everyone, welcome back to The Native Family. If you're new here, welcome. If you're returning, hey family, hey. I have a 99 cent store haul for you guys and at the end I wanted to have a little talk with you. I am going to go ahead and get started. It's not a great big haul, but to me it's some items that are, I think, really good. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Rhiannon needed a, a composition book. I think these are just the spiral notebook. She needed it for math. It's not the prettiest, it's all they had, but she did need it right away. Um, let's see what else I found. This is a repurchase. This is the Art Naturals Beauty Art and Na um, Nature Makeup Remover Pure and Natural. Rhiannon and Angie actually like this product, so I did pick them up another bottle. They're almost done with the first bottle that I got them. I was looking for the Martha Stewart measuring spoons <laughs> and didn't find them or the measuring cups, but I did need to get new items for the kitchen because I do like to... Uh, replace things as they're getting older and this is the Farber wear and it's $1.99 and you get two of the silicone whisks one of the larger ones and one of the smaller ones and I think for $1.99 that's a great buy so I picked those up um, I think oh and I have this for non-food okay so I really really wanted these when I saw them on Instagram this is the Urban House design letter board, it, letter board. It's eight by in, eight inches. I can't talk today, guys. Sorry. And it's only $2.99 and you get 183 p um, pieces. So I got two of these because I want one in the kitchen and I think one by my desk would be cute too. I like when the kids um, put their own quotes on things. Um, I might, I, God, I wish I could have one in each room. I just love the size of these. They did have like a velvet background one. I just thought that would get too dusty, too easy, too hard to clean. So I picked up two of these for $2.99. You can't beat that because I've seen them go for a lot more at Target. So that was my extra special buy. I was so stoked when I found it. I'll go ahead and get into the food items now. This is my husband and my mother-in-law's favorite tea. This is the Gold Peak Tea. It's the sweet tea. This is the one gallon. And we never find, you know, the big, huge teas, especially the sweet tea. I've spent, they had the unsweetened tea as well, but it is Super Bowl Sunday coming up this weekend. So I did pick up three of these so that they can have those. For the kids to have a special treat because it is the weekend, I did get them the Western Family Creamy Select uh, berry cheesecake. Rhiannon and Angie have been asking for that. Um, we don't have Wolf right now. Hopefully by Easter we will get to see him. But that's another day, another story. So I picked up one of those. Now this cereal is actually really good. And I hope you guys can see it because I'm using a different um, tripod today. This is the peanut butter chocolate blasted shreds. It's by General Mills. This cereal is good without milk. I mean it's good with milk too. If you use almond milk especially. But I like warm shredded wheats, and I don't know if you guys have ever tried it before, if, but if you take this in a little bit of warm almond milk, it is to die for. Super good. Um, it's good until March 28th of 2019, so it has a good life onto it, but it won't last that long here, trust me. Tonight we are doing movie night, and it is pizza night, so I did pick up some snacks for the kids. This is the peanut candy. It's Masapan covered in chocolate. Oh my gosh, I want a bite of this so bad. But this is one of my kids' favorite candy, so I picked that up for movie night. The hubby is a Junior Mint person, so I got the Junior Mint Minis. And this is a 4.5 ounce bag, and it's resealable. So I really like that it's resealable. Then they had the Junior Caramels, so I picked those up. I opened these because I actually want to show you guys what these look like. This is the Dove Cashews, and they're dipped in silky smooth milk chocolate and dusted with sea salt. They are $1.99. This is one of my new favorite like indulgences. I want to show you what they look like in case you guys haven't seen them. If I can get one out. And this is what they look like. Now, you know when chocolate gets old, sometimes it'll look like it's dusty. This is not the case here. It's dusted with sea salt. It's supposed to look like this. So don't open it and think you got old chocolate. These are amazing. If you like sweet and salty, I would recommend you getting them. If you're not into the whole sweet and salty thing don't waste your dollar 99 but if you do like it it is so worth it oh it's such a good 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 yum 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 <laughs> sorry guys so this is um what is it the bella toscana R R rigatoni boy i can't talk today guys <laughs> anyways it's almost two pounds of macaroni and I'm going to be making a homemade Alfredo sauce to go with the Super Bowl food that I'm making this weekend so I needed to pick one of these up 
Oh, okay. I have this open already because I had to get it home and get it in the freezer. But this is the Lucerne Dairy Farms Creamy Orange Ice Cream Bars. This is a Pavilions or Vons brand or maybe Safeway because I know Safeway and Vons are sister stores. But these were only 99 cents and I know in the grocery store they're more because I do buy these at the Pavilions and sometimes they are two for four or three ninety nine depending on the sale but you get 12 of them and I got them for a buck so those are already in the freezer so they wouldn't melt I did pick up some of the these are open too the kool-aid jammers of the sparklers the grape I got three of the grape two of them are already in the fridge one I have for backup in case they run out the kids really like these and then I was able to find the tropical punch I did get three of these as well I need to get some of these in the fridge so you get six of them and I saw these at Walmart for $3.99 each so to get them for a buck each you can't beat that and then I did pick up one more of the coffee mate cheesecake factory in the Dulce Leche and it's in one uh, it's $1.99 this is a good price you guys haven't tried this this stuff is so good uh, a couple more food items I needed apples to make my chicken salad with and this is how many pounds is this uh, two pounds of the opal apples so I did get that for snacking and for the chicken salad I am going to be doing a video on the chicken salad and I've already done a video on the chicken pot pie that I told you I was gonna make but these are really unique apples I like them they're sweet and a little uh, tart at the same time they kind of remind me of a pear apple in a way so those are really good and those are $1.99 for two pounds I like the way the Ariel um, laundry soap works. I wish they had a bigger bag, but they only had the smaller bags. Um, it's only 500 grams. I'm not sure what that is in weight, but this will go pretty good. I do not have a washer and dryer in my condo. I actually have to go to the laundry mat. So this is, makes it easy for me to take, and it smells so good, and it actually really works well on cleaning the clothes. Along with laundry stuff, I did get the Clorox uh, Fragancia again. This is a repurchase. This one is in the spring. This stuff smells so good. Like I can smell it right now. And it is a bonus pack. Instead of 20 sheets, you get 25 sheets. So I picked that up. You guys all know, excuse the light. It is bright in here today. You guys all know that I do get the 12 pack of toilet tissue because we go through it like crazy. I was just at Costco. I should have picked up the big 35 pack, but I didn't. I don't keep soda in the house unless it's special occasion or we have guests and it is Super Bowl Sunday. So I did get a Diet Shasta, the cola, and the, uh, what is the other one? Lemon lime soda. So this will last the whole Super Bowl Sunday. And of course, you know, if we get a couple Coronas or whatever, whatnot. So that is my haul. This is what I buy on the normal. Um, I'm not trying to haul to buy everything in the store buy things that i don't need i mean it's very easy to go to the 99 cent store and go crazy in there but budget wise and common sense wise for me it doesn't make sense for me to continue keep buying things that i'm not going to be using or utilizing right away so i do apologize if my hauls are starting to look a little smaller to you guys but this is real life this is what i actually buy at the 99 cent store I'm not into doing um, videos as a competition of who found it first, who's the best, who did this, who did that. I am here because I want to share with you guys how I help my family save money and to support each other. There is an amazing group of people that are 99 cent haulers, dollar tree haulers, people that do recipes, crafters. We have an awesome community here on YouTube. Um, my buddy Sway just started a channel a couple weeks ago, and that is Sway to the 99, just like his Instagram handle. And he does really good, healthy meal prep and meal ideas from the 99. You know, he does hauls, he does walkthroughs. He has a beautiful channel. You know, Mama for Nicole has a beautiful channel. The Mom Life 7 has a beautiful channel. There's so many people out there that are doing hauls to help their family save money. And they're doing it for a good reason. And I am really proud to be part of that community. So if you guys are still continuing to enjoy my videos, please give me a big thumbs up. If you have not subscribed already, hit that subscribe button. You know, don't forget to like the video. Share it with somebody that you think might be interested in some of the things that we find. 
And don't forget to be kind, inspire, be inspired, and remember we're all human and we're just trying to make things work for our families. Um, if I don't shout you out, it's not that I don't watch you. I just got to remember everybody's names. But I will talk to you guys next time and I hope everybody is having a great, great Friday. Um, this won't be going up until Saturday. So I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.